Hey guys, RC Bros Productions here. In this video, I'll be showing you how to replace a drive shaft, a middle drive shaft or center drive shaft, whatever you want to call it, in your Traxxas T-Max 3.3, or I believe it's the same for the normal T-Max Classic. So first off, you're going to need to uh, unscrew a little hex uh, screw with a little pin on it right here. So if you can see that, it's right there. You need to unscrew that. Or if it's with the other one, then you just do it right here. I, if you are replacing this one right here, you do need to take off the skid plate in order to access this little screw. Okay, there we go. And now the whole thing should just pop right off like this. There we go. Now it's completely popped off. Next, we're going to be removing this little C-clip right here. And if you got a, a new T-Max, then you should have this little tool right here that came with it. We're gonna be using this side right here to pop it out. So just, it kind of has a little play in it, so push down on one side so it pops up, and just push out the E-clip, like, like this. It might, it might be a little difficult at first. All right. You might need a small screwdriver as well. This, in this case, this is a really small one. Just kind of push it from one side. I have to try this again. There we go, it's starting to pop out. There we go, now it's out. And then, from there, you can push this little pin out right here. Just pull it out. And then this whole assembly comes out right here. And this pin should slide out. Then you take your new axle piece, slide this in, put this in right here. Make sure it's the right one too, because there's two different size holes there. So just slide that in. Make sure the holes are aligned. Push it in. be a little difficult to push in because it's a new axle here. I'm just gonna use this to kind of push push it in there. Okay. All right. And once the holes are aligned, push your pin back through. Move it. Move it this way. There we go. Put this in. We're going to put the little C clip back on, or E clip, whatever you want to call it. Either name works. All right. Getting it on is a little bit more difficult than getting it off. Okay, let's see here. Just kind of. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Earlier it was a little bit more difficult, and then just kind of, it's going to be really tight in the new axle. Just kind of wiggle it a little bit. Maybe spray some WD-40 or some type of lubrication on there, just to get it. A little bit more uh, lubricated. Here, I'm going to spray some WD-40 on it. Here we go. Now it should be a little bit more lubricated. Perfect. All right. Now that we've got this assembly put back together, what you're going to do is slide this. Let me get the flashlight on. Slide this back into the other piece. Push it all the way in so you can fit it in there. And then let's see, let's get this on, put it on there. Oops, oh, the other way. There we go. Oh, it's taking a little bit of time to get on there. Oh, almost. There we go, got it. Now get the little uh, pin or screw and then just push it back in. And then screw it back in place. And it doesn't have to be super tight. It just has to be in there all the way. Just like that. There we go. 
now it's complete. Thanks for watching. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Bye.